Let me drop off some wisdom before I go to work. Y'all see the title, man. We got to keep a clear head out here, man. We can't be running around with cloudy brains. We can't be running around with cloudy minds, you know what I'm saying? We got to do whatever we have to do to maintain a clear headspace on a regular basis, man. Because we can't be out here operating and, and making moves and trying to make decisions. We got too much noise. We got too much chatter. We got too much uh, uh, stuff that we need to do. You know, we got too many ideas or we got too many um, we got too many uh, uh, tasks and stuff that we need to take care of swimming around up here, you know. So it's kind of similar to the last video I made about figuring out how to let go and, and figure out what gives you that feeling of relief. We also got to figure out what helps us maintain a clear head, you know. So like for for example, for me. I know that meditation helps me keep a clear mind, speaking, you know, journaling, making these videos and stuff like that, being creative, all those things help my mental stay clear, you know, because I'm getting things out of there, you know, and it's real easy to get caught up in, you know, not keeping your mind clear because of how many things that we have to do. You know, so many things that we're responsible for. So many things that we have to take care of. You know what I'm saying? Um, and really, I'm doing all that is because uh, a lot of those things are... A lot of those things that I just named are all things that, you know, are expected from us because of society. You know what I'm saying? A lot of those things are... It's just the way that the society is run. You know, it's just... It's busy, busy, busy. You know, always on go. You know gas or uh, foot on the gas you know what i'm saying like that hustle culture but realistically like that shit gets tiring that shit gets old and it's it can do a number on your mind especially when you don't take that time to actually sit back and just recover from it you know what i'm saying because a lot of times just getting good sleep ain't enough <laughs> like if you got shit on your mind and then you go to sleep you wake up the next day and it's still there, you know what I'm saying? You still got to deal with it. You still got to process it. You still got to sort through it, you know what I'm saying? So, and that's something that I've been dealing with, you know, these past couple of days, you know what I'm saying? Like, I got stuff going on and whatnot. And, you know, I sleep good every night. Don't get me wrong. But, you know, it's easier for me to sleep good when my mind is clear, you know what I'm saying? When, I dealt, when I've dealt with those things that have, that might be hanging over me, you know what I'm saying? Like, sometimes I might, like, lately what I've been doing is in the morning like when i make uh when i make my coffee and shit i uh what i try to do is i leave i try to just sit with my thoughts until i finish my coffee like i, I boil the water it's like an instant coffee it ain't nothing like you know it, it ain't it ain't like regular coffee or whatever but it's like i try to like that whole process boiling the water putting it in the water mixing it together waiting for it to cool down you know what I'm saying? And I just sit there with my thoughts until I finish, until I finish the coffee, until I, until I drink it all. You know what I'm saying? Like my phone is either off or it's on airplane mode and I might be like writing something, but it's like nobody can really get to me. Like I can't really get to the outside world. It's like I'm just kind of dealing with myself like at the top of the day, you know, like I've just been sitting out, um, sitting at my house, like just looking out the window and just, just sorting through my shit, you know what I'm saying? Before I even get the day started, you know what I'm saying? And that's... I've been enjoying that, you know what I'm saying? It kind of just sets the tone for the day and, you know what I'm saying, giving myself space as soon as the day starts, you know what I'm saying? So um, hopefully all that made sense. I don't want to drag this on too long. I got to go to work in like two minutes. <laughs> but um, yeah, man, just maintain a clear headspace. Whatever you got to do, whatever gives you that, that, that sense of relief up here, make sure that's something you keep that in your rotation, you know what I'm saying? It's, it should be like... You should have like three to five things that you can go to that just can help you clear your mind and just figure out which one you need um, at different points. Like whichever one is, is the easiest, whichever one is working the most, stick with that one. You know what I'm saying? And, and and just have them other backup ones for whenever you need them, man, because we need it. You know what I'm saying? We can't be out here running around with just shit just hanging out up here. You know what I'm saying? Like it's too many people that are like that already. And I hate I hate seeing people like that. They just they just got shit going on, and it's just it's it's very obvious to me when people are like that. And 
we don't need to have any more people like that. You know what I'm saying? So whatever you got to do to keep that clear, please do it because you're doing yourself a favor. And then when you're doing yourself a favor, you're doing yourself, you're doing the world a favor because everybody around you is, uh, is, is in a way they're benefiting from you having a clear mind. You know what I'm saying? It's like a domino effect. It's like everybody's like a wave. You know what I'm saying? So with all that being said, man, y'all take it easy. Hope y'all like what I was saying. And, uh, I'm going to catch y'all on the next one, man. Y'all take it easy. Keep your mind clear. Peace.